feel low, you can still go Even when you feel slow, you can still go Even when there's no hope, you can still go I never ran so What's up guys, ladies and gentlemen Welcome back to the channel Where we talk cryptocurrency and passive income opportunities in the digital world My name is Crypto DeFi Guru And in today's video, we're gonna discuss the polls Announced by EM Foundation As I told you in the, my previous video uh, That we are going to cover um, the uh, polls uh, if you're new, please do subscribe and turn on the bell icon to receive more of my new videos. And with no further ado, let's get started right now. Um, this is the EM Foundation website where you get the polls. First of all, you need to have uh, a Panam or a Safe Zone Pass to participate in this voting. And you know what? A Safe Zone Pass is free forever. You don't need to pay for it to get this uh, Panam. So this is the website. Uh, let's first check the yen value. Uh, sitting at 25,774. Wow. Still heading up while the market is down. First of all, you need to log in uh, with your safe zone pass. Okay. Then the password as usual. Then the pin. Okay. Um, you submit. Then uh, this is the main website right now. When you log in, you come here and click um, click here for the pause. Then um, this is the information 2022 pause. So all this information we went uh, it was uh, shared in the webinar. We discussed about it. Let's go straight to the pause. Uh, remember you have time until January 9th, 2023. At 12 p.m. U.S. Pacific time to make your vote. So these are the polls. We have one, two, and three. So we are going to discuss them. Uh, before voting, we need to understand what we are voting for. Now uh, that's the good thing with EM Foundation. You have the power to vote on certain things here. So this is poll one. Um, since Martha withdrew from a BID for personal reasons. Our elected U.S. National Director Rodolfo Abbas filled the gap. He is focused on organizing the election procedure for national directors. So here is the question: Shall Rodolfo be a fixed member of the BID until the um, next official elections for the BID quarter one, 2024? So you um, say yes or no. So this is replacing uh, Rodolfo is replacing Martha, and is going to organize and these uh, elections for national directors so people who are interested in these positions uh, the chance is here for you uh, so as a yam holder you have the opportunity or you have the chance to participate you have the chance to submit in uh, to be a representative of your country here so now here as a yam holder the question you either say yes or no uh, you click yes or no and click submit so this is poll number one then poll number two, um, uh, we are all very excited about the Sovereign Order Ben Merenti picking him as their official legal tender. Uh, the legal team advised us that for many yam holders, it might be a big difference holding big amounts of yam which are treated in most jurisdictions uh, as a virtual or cryptocurrency or to have fiat currency in their wallet. Depending on your tax jurisdiction, you might need to pay significantly higher taxes on the value, uh, the increase in value, or both on fiat currencies. Thus, we, uh, we discussed options and found that our proof of stake might be the perfect solution uh, with some small modifications. So, this is uh, the options IEM Foundation is giving us according to the advice that they got from their legal team. This is the first um, option. Uh, we would need to remove the automatic withdraw function after the selected holding time. Uh, then option two, we would need uh, to convert EM to free EM at deposit and convert them back into EM at withdraw. Uh, yeah. Free EM are not a currency, but under a uh, legal aspects, a customer real to reality token or reward. Uh, so the third would allow partial withdrawal from proof of stake. Thus, you can decide at any time if you want to withdraw 
uh, from proof of stake or your EM or just a part of it. So this the, some confusion here. Some people have been uh, saying these people uh, they want to convert our EM into a free EM. This program uh, it will be an option. If at all uh, it goes through, it will be an option. You either put in your EM in proof of stake or you don't put there. So it will be an option. Here they say as a result, uh, the tax situation for many EM holders should be much better. This is just a general impression because this is not any kind of individual tax advice. Uh, always discuss your personal tax situation with a licensed tax expert for your tax deductions. As a side effect, due to more free EM in proof of stake, the number of EM in circulation will be lower. Thus, the market capitalization of, capitalization of EM will be lower. So, uh, this will cause uh, some impact on the number of EM in circulation to be lower and the market uh, capitalization will be lower. So, in this uh, poll, what you need to understand that uh, this uh, the EM Foundation they are helping you as a EM holder because uh, they, they understand that in some countries they may tax you, they may tax your money seated in the wallet. Okay, so to avoid that, uh, they give you an option to either put your EM in the proof of stake as free EM, and when you want it back, you convert it into uh, the real EM. Okay, you can. Uh, convert it back into real EM and it will be an option where you can withdraw from proof of stake uh, part of it or the whole of your EM. So it's an option, it will be an option. So the question is shall the proof of stake be modified as described above? You either say yes or no. I uh, hope that's understood. Then poll number three. Uh, this is interesting because it's concerning withdrawing and uh, concerning liquidity. And that's what people want to hear. <laughs> uh, so it goes like this. We are all waiting for some liquidity from official EM sales at the EM exchange. We shall be used after EM foundation expenses to buy EM from the EM holders at the digital exchange center. Thus, it makes sense to find uh, fair rules. And the BID is very thanks thankful for the vital discussion and many proposals from the EM community. It seems to be clear that the best and the most wanted solution is to evenly share any available USD amount uh, with all EM holders who are interested in selling some of their EM. So it is important to understand that uh, no EM holders should expect any guaranteed sale through this program, nor can this program replace your own activities to sell or to convert EM as desired. Uh, at the same time, the EM Foundation has no capacities to overlook and perform an additional administrative workload while buying EM from the EM holders. Therefore, we suggest the following rules. So here are the, are the suggestions you are going to vote for. Um, all EM holders who would like to participate will depost 0 0.1 or 0 0.1 EM born or before January 20, January 31st, 2023. Uh, on February 15th, 2023, we divide any available uh, dollar amount by the number of participating GM holders. Uh, the dollar amount together with the remaining GM balance will be transferred to your wallet. If you want to participate again, you will need to make a new deposit. If there is no um, dollar amount to be shared, the EM will roll over to the next month. Deposits for the next month's distribution uh, need to be deposited before the end of each month. The EM amount deposited uh, needs to be the same for each participant so that the distribution is, uh, of dollar amount can be automated. All USD amount will be distributed as USDT into wallets of participating game holders. USDT can be converted and transferred to a bank account at www.digitalassets.consulting. Uh, so this is uh, where uh, people are interested and this is the good news. Uh, guys, um, from January, we shall be receiving some um, 
people will start selling uh, their yen, yen foundation will be buying from the from the digital exchange center. But when it, what you need to know, uh, the mid the you need to deposit uh, 0.1 yen uh, before Jan, okay? So that on on February 15th you get uh, your money, okay? Uh, this sale. But it's not a guarantee that they will buy 0.1. It will be spent on the liquidity, which will be available. If the liquidity, if they have enough liquidity, that means they will buy you 0.1 EM. Okay, that's around 2,500 dollars. Um, and if there's no enough liquidity, they will not buy you 0.1. You might buy from 0 or 0.005 according to what will be and their liquidity but they will start buying from january 2023 is that is that isn't exciting uh, people have been waiting for that and the remaining amount will be transferred back to your wallet so that if you want to participate next month you deposit again that's how the, the, the it will be working okay so what you you earn in your uh, in your wallet will give you they will send you usdt into your wallets and then you transfer that USDT to the bank account. Okay. In, the, in my next video, I will show you how uh, to how you can uh, withdraw your USDT to your bank account, guys. So this is the question: Shall the program be installed as described above? You, uh, you either click yes or no. Okay. Uh, but I think all people <laughs> vote yes <laughs> because people want money. And this program will not replace your, as they told you, this program will be going on, but you continue doing what you've been doing, uh, private orders, uh, as you've been doing. You can sell your YM at any time, uh, as YM Foundation is also buying from you, okay? Uh, so YM holders, the time for success is about to come. As I told you guys, um, YM will become a success, okay? As we all we all know that Team Foundation right now is doing a great job. We need to support it. We need to uh, give them applaud. They are doing a great job for us. So I will show you how to transfer all those uh, things to your bank account. Why you need what you need, the requirements you need to transfer your funds to the bank account. I will show you all those things. But just know from January, um, you started depositing your 0 0.1 EM. In the whole of Jan, you have time the whole of Jan, so before 31st, okay, you put your 0.1. If you have orders already on the exchange, you can go and cancel them and you put 0.1. You cancel those orders, public orders you you, you had put on the digital exchange center, then and you put in 0.1, okay, sell. Uh, then on February 15th, expect something from EM Foundation expect some money from yem foundation if all goes well if there are no changes uh, you receive some money from yem foundation and the deposit they need is 0 0.1 so this is uh, what guys we have been waiting for hope guys you got some value out of this video and uh, don't forget to subscribe and feel free to leave your comment below thank you for watching happy holidays